Hi, I'm Bill O'Brien. This is Inside Music Today, and we're with Mayor Khan from Cherry Hill, New Jersey, where we're going to be doing our 19th anniversary show. And we're going to be talking with Mayor Chuck Khan from Cherry Hill in a few minutes. Angel Cassiano with his second concept video. We love making those videos. They look good, sound good. And our first road show from the Shamrock Pub in Philadelphia. We uh, have part two coming up for you, If All Else Fails, and also another song from Mike and Flora. And we had a great time there. It was uh, all of, Everybody showed up. We did good. Part one was last week. This is part two, and let's get the show started with Mike and Flora going to be doing a second song for you. It goes like this. We are going to continue with one of mine. This is a song I wrote for my daughter when she was a baby. And now she's a college freshman. She goes to Bryn Mawr, not too far from here. So time goes by real fast. This uh, song is called Sweet Face. You can shake your maracas on this one, too. <laughs>
Ladies and gentlemen, one more time, Mike and Flora, Woo! and uh, Mr. Gun Thank you very much. All right, you guys are good, man. I, like, I think that I think they like the mummer stuff. I got I got a good sign back there that they uh, they like that was going on. All right, we'll be right back up with somebody else coming. Uh, who's coming up next? I forgot. All right, Mike and Flora, second song. I think that was Flora's song. She wrote that one a little while ago. This is all happening at the Shamrock Pub. This is our first road show. We had a great time and. Uh, you might want to visit the place, 1400 South 2nd Street, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Do you need extra cash for the holidays or extra cash to pay your bill? Whatever your needs are, I want to buy your gold. I want to buy your gold. I want to buy your gold. At Quick Fix Jewelry Repair, we are paying the highest prices for your gold. We even buy silver, silver coins, platinum, and diamonds. Don't send your gold through the mail and don't go to a hotel. Come into Quick Fix, where we have 25 years of experience and we are someone you can trust. Because we give you the highest price, I want to buy your gold. Why does Dr. Lou's food taste so good? It's because of his sauce and dressing. You just put it in a bottle. At Dr. Lou's place in Roebling, New Jersey, we sell an awful lot of wings. And ever since, there's been this chicken following us around. Because Dr. Lou's wings are so different and special, it's starting to make the chickens nuts. So if you're crazy about your wings, run on over to Dr. Lou's at the we'll tracks in Roebling, right off Route 130, and get great wings, cheesesteaks, and more at insane prices. Don't foul up. Get the wings that make the chickens stalk us. Right here, Dr. Lou's Place. Live music restaurant. All right, from the Shamrock Pub, 1400 South 2nd Street, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, here's If All Else Fails. They're doing an acoustic show for us. That's unusual. Their band sounds great. Well, you know what they say, if all else fails, bring them to the Shamrock Pub, 2nd and Reed Street, all right? That's what we did tonight on Inside Music Today. they got a song coming up right now that's original music. What are you going to call this one, guys? This one is called Ghost of Yesterday. Ghosts of Yesterday. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, if all else fails, listen to what they're going to do. All right.
searching for the sun, waiting for tomorrow, but it never comes. And I've watched yesterday drift into the sky. In times like these. Six-piece band, five-piece five besides you guys. Yep, uh, three of them. You got a guitar player, bass player, drummer. That's three. You two. Uh, I thought there was one more. Uh, okay. Second a second guitar player. Yeah. There's a second guitar player. His ego also plays. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. You got one of those too, huh? <laughs> anyway, if all those fails, then hit, bring a band back one time. We'll see what we can do. They're gonna be on my show in June 8th. Uh, June 8th, I think. Yeah, June 8th in Cherry Hill, New Jersey. We got four. By the way, did I tell you guys they're in high school? For all you musicians out there? Damn. All right. One more time, please. All right. Good job. Thank you. Thank you guys. We'll be right back with you with the next group. Okay, if all else fails, the acoustic all else fails. We're going to have their band on a June 8th show, coming up on our anniversary show. Uh, I think they earned it. Angel, what are you doing, man? Hey, how you doing, man? I was just reading uh, this month's issue of Out in the Town magazine. They got an article here about uh, Inside Music Today and what it does around the city for upcoming bands. Oh, look at that. Look at that, yeah. It's a great article written by Mr. Lou Picca. Yeah. You called? Oh, there goes Lou right there. He's got another article over here on page 22. I love his articles. I mean, he comes up with some really cool stuff to write about. You got to check him out on Out of the Town magazine. 
Do you need extra cash for the holidays or extra cash to pay your bill? Whatever your needs are, I want to buy your gold. I want to buy your gold. I want to buy your gold. At Quick Fix Jewelry Repair, we are paying the highest prices for your gold. We even buy silver, silver coins, platinum, and diamonds. Don't send your gold through the mail and don't go to a hotel. Come into Quick Fix, where we have 25 years of experience and we are someone you can trust. Because we give you the highest price, I want to buy your gold. Why does Dr. Lou's food taste so good? It's because of his sauce and dressing. You just put it in a bottle. At Dr. Lou's place in Roebling, New Jersey, we sell an awful lot of wings. And ever since, there's been this chicken following us around. Because Dr. Lou's wings are so different and special, it's starting to make the chickens nuts. So if you're crazy about your wings, run on over to Dr. Lou's at the we'll tracks in Roebling, right off Route 130, we'll and get great wings, cheesesteaks, and more at insane prices. Then. Don't we'll foul up. The get the wings then. that make the chickens we'll stalk us. Right here, Dr. Lou's Place, live music restaurant. All right, Woodstock Trading Company, you've seen the house on Route 70. Next time, stop in. You're going to be surprised. And coming up, don't forget our 19th anniversary show, June 8th, seven bands, a celebration. Uh, we're going to have the mayor there. A whole lot of things are going to be going on. Speaking of the mayor, Mayor Chuck Kahn, we, uh, we got part two of the conversation that we had with him, and it uh, goes like this. Hi, I'm Bill O'Brien. We're back with the mayor of Cherry Hill. And uh, we, uh, to continue the segment that we did last week, there's a lot of information that you guys ought to know. But first, I want to tell you why Croft Farm is so good. We went out there and did a site check. Uh, I've done a lot of concerts outside. This is almost, I feel about the same way that the guys did when they saw Woodstock. Like, here's the hill, and, and the stage is going to be here. Everything, is, it was just a natural setup. Tell me, Mr. Mayor, why Croft Farm is, like a, a, is one of your museums? What else do you? What else happens there besides like concerts? Well, I love the reference to Woodstock because when I try when I travel to uh, the Croft Farm, it kind of reminds me of the same, in terms of the open woods and the fields that are there, the trails, the park, the. Um, are these walking trails? It is walking trails, and how the, far do they go? Do you know the like the mileage? You guessable? It's a few miles that go across, but you know the lakes and the streams, the nature that that exists there. It's just an incredible place, and you just feel one with nature when you walk through it. And, and did Cherry Hill put the walkway through, or are they kind of like a natural it's, path? It's or? a combination of both. They've existed there since the early 1700s. 1700s? And, you know, it was a working farm and a mill and an old ice house that, that existed there and a beautiful farm that, uh, and a house that's mm -hmm. just incredible. Well, we're going to get some shots of that so we can show the people what we're talking about. Aside from the stage, which I so generously provided for Inside Music Today to do our 19th anniversary show. And uh, it's going to be a good show, folks. You'll see. Uh, we're going to do the promo after this, after I get done talking. And uh, we'll show you some of the bands that are on the show. And uh, an explanation of why are you letting me do this? I mean, I feel so good that you're letting me do this. I'm, you know, you have concerts for what kind of groups besides like a rock fest kind of a thing? Well, we do uh, culture. Uh, cultural arts is very important to Cherry Hill. And music under the stars is something that we promote throughout the year. Uh, music and education, uh, our children are, are really important to Cherry Hill. All that we do uh, throughout the year, um, Cherry Hill is just a great place to live and work. And uh, I think it's important to promote Cherry Hill in a, in a great way and all the, all the uh, education that goes on here. I think it's important for us to support uh, all of our residents and, and the kids uh, that want to come out and well, I work hard you, for Cherry Hill. I haven't been in Cherry Hill in a lot of years because it's been taking me further south and further north. But I just passed where the old racetrack used to be. I used to work around the corner from the racetrack. I had no idea. I thought I was in a different city. I mean, it looks like a city by itself. It's, you've got store names that are like big. I, you know, how's that doing for the town? Is that it's all right? It's doing fabulous. We have one of the most successful malls uh, in, in the country. Uh, we're a town of 26 square miles. We're the 12th yeah. largest city in New Jersey. Wow. Uh, almost 82,000 people. Wow. Um, we're, we've been very successful and very proud of what we've done. And um, very, uh, very satisfied that we've been continue to support our economic development in this town. We provide an excellent education. Our schools are fabulous. And they got two high school folks. And two, two high schools. And uh, it's a great place to live and work. 
And uh, now you get along with the council and everything like that, Very and much the archives so. and things like that. How far? How how old is the town itself? Like, uh, I, the, I remember when Cherry Hill Mall was built, and that was like, whoa! If that's dating my age, hey, I am that age. So, but you built up from there. I mean, Cherry Hill was based on the mall. Then well, came you know, that. Cherry Hill was based on farms. And, oh, it was yeah, farms. Yeah, it was, that's what I want to know. How's, how's... Goes back to the farmlands in the late 1600s. It uh -huh. was all farms. Um, I was lucky enough to be born and raised in, in Cherry Hill myself. Wow. And, and I remember when uh, half of Cherry Hill was all farmlands. And to see the progression of Cherry Hill just in the 50 or 60 years that I've been here, it's, it's a huge transformation. And it, it's just been just been great. Yourself and all your predecessors did a great job. This Absolutely. town is looking like a lot I said, of hard I work. I haven't been here in a while, but we just drove around looking at everything. Really a good town, and I hope the kids in school appreciate what you guys are doing for them. Because when I was in school, we never did. You know, you know, it's like you know, when you're a student, you don't appreciate what the town's doing. And there are good towns and bad towns, folks. This happens to be a good town. Cherry Hill at Croft Farm, June eighth. So we're going to do the concert. That's going to be in, in, in about two weeks. All right. So, uh, but we'll give you more information next week. We're going to have the mayor come back and uh, can talk a little more about Croft Farm and what goes on here in Cherry Hill. Thanks for tuning in, Mayor. Thank you. We'll see you next Thanks week. All right. Here. Can we well, come back next it. week and talk? Thank you. Absolutely. Uh, beautiful. Look to it. Okay. All right, Mayor Chuck Khan from Cherry Hill, New Jersey. You know, I deal with a lot of mayors, and uh, a lot of them don't like to get involved. This guy wants to get involved. Great stuff. Angel Castellano with his uh, second concept video. We like making them. We like showing them. If you got one, let us know.
so tired of being by myself I just don't want to cry anymore Oh, I hope there is a chance That I can get that feeling That one that makes me dance And since my sense is real Mr. Angel Cassiano's second concept video. Good stuff, I liked it. And our first road show at the Shamrock Pub, 2nd Street, Philadelphia, if all else fails. Mike and Flora, two songs. Mayor Chuck Kahn, Cherry Hill, and the Woodstock Trading Company, one of the sponsors for the 19th anniversary celebration show, June 8th, seven bands. Don't miss it, tell somebody about it. And I want to thank my sponsors, Dr. Lou's Place, for letting us record there. Doing a lot of songs there. He's got the mall shop opening up. We're going to be doing some live shows from up there. Uh, I want to thank everybody for tuning in. I'm Bill O'Brien. We'll see you next week.